Welcome back to Grizz Vision here on Grizz TV. My name is Neil Rule here with Coach Campy after an 87-76 win over old foe Oral Roberts in the arena. And Coach, when you look at this basketball game here tonight, uh, Javen Cumberland showed what you all knew he was capable of when you recruited him here with 30-plus points. Xavier Hill Mays in the upper 20s again. And, and defensively, I know you're not happy with the rebounding, but defensively when it came down to it, you guys made the stops. Yeah, I mean, our defense all year has been pretty good. Our, our ball screen defense has to get better. Um, we wear out in games, but the problem is we don't rebound, and and it's a big problem. If we don't fix it, it's gonna it's just gonna derail our season. We, you know, we're we're six eleven, six nine, six seven. We bring six seven off the bench. We bring six five off the bench. We should be a good rebounding team. We're athletic. We're long, but we don't. I don't. We're not physical enough. We don't. We don't check out the way we're capable, the way we want them to. And there's a lot of work to do on that. If we've got to fix that. Uh, you know, Oral Roberts was pretty much decimated on the boards last night by Northern Illinois, and then they did that to us. They had 24 second chance points. So tomorrow's going to be a tough day. If if we don't check out, we won't win tomorrow. Coach Braden Norris, the, the freshman, getting the start at, at point guard, kind of pressed into that duty. Were, were you expecting this? He was in double figures again here today, just one turnover as well, with constant backcourt pressure. Yeah, he and Cumberland did a great job against the press. They, they committed one turnover each. Both of them were glaring turnovers. So they, they, one was <laughs> in the half court, and Cumberland's was get to a layup. Um, but to handle that kind of pressure for 40 minutes and, and not turn the ball over. And I believe Cumberland's like 30 assists and three turnovers on the year, and, and Braden's probably now 20 assists and six turnovers or something. So uh, they're doing a heck of a job getting us in our offense. We had 26 baskets and 22 assists again. I think we're one of the top teams in the country in assisting on your baskets. Uh, we average over 20 assists a game and 25 baskets or something like that. So so they're doing a great job. We're running good, solid offense. We have our lapses where we don't shoot it well and where we take some quick, bad shots. But for the most part, we're doing that good. There's a lot of good going on, uh, but you know, there's a lot of learning we have to do, and these games are helping us learn. So tomorrow, Northern Illinois, uh, you guys will wrap up play here in the tournament. Third game in three nights uh, for both sides. How, how does that change things, not just for you, but for Northern Illinois as well? Well, they played a lot more guys than we did today, and I'm disappointed with myself that I didn't uh, sub more. You know, we have 10 guys drafted, and I, my plan was to play all 10 double-figure minutes today, and I didn't get Stan in, and Kamara only played three minutes, and um, he's a better player than that. He probably needs to play more. Uh, but I just I wanted to get the win. I, I just felt it's imperative that we get this win today. And so I went with the guys, and, and that could hurt us tomorrow. But those guys will be fresh tomorrow, and they'll get some minutes. All right, Coach. See you in about 21 hours. All right, Neil.